hello everyone and welcome back to my channel it is stephanie of kiki planning back again for another video and in today's video we will be planning out the week of april 5th through the 11th using this kit from creativity and ink and she is a stunner um so really quickly let me just go ahead and flip through this i did pick this up in the hollow foil so these are the full boxes the like box page the like not decorative functional functional page um and then the bottom washi page and i also did pick up a bunch of extras so i picked up the glitter header add-on and then there was um these checklists that came with the kit and then i also picked up this really cute like sparkly die cut and then this came with the kit as a freebie for like ordering it the weekend that it came out and it says you are just as sane as i am with luna specter specs and i love this luna is by far my favorite character of the entire harry potter series um so i figured like this would be the perfect kit to use in my fandom planner for my birthday month because birth month april um just because like i am using only like my favorite type stuff for this month so really quickly let me just go ahead and flip through the current week we i am filming this on the saturday so this is what the week is turning out like honestly it's pretty like the same as to what the spread looked like previously um but really quickly i am just going to start laying down the base and be back in two seconds and as per not usual but like last week i did the silver bougie boxes and this week i am doing hollow bougie boxes and i am pulling in this tape from rose colored days so i'm just gonna play some potterless podcasts and then we'll get on to the more day by day section in like two seconds <laughs> section of the like base spread so basically just did the sidebar checklist state covers and the bottom washi and now i'm gonna go ahead and move on to the full boxes so i kind of space it out to be like top no top bottom top middle bottom top middle bottom um so this one is bottom one for monday I guess I could just be through doing this part too and then this one is a top one. I'm not really like doing I'm not really doing anything like special in particular for these full boxes. I'm basically just gonna go in the order that their insistence is gonna be for the middle on Wednesday and then the bottom on Thursday. This header is like actually really crooked and I probably should not have pulled that up, but too late now this like the paper is super unforgiving in terms of like pulling things up and trying to put them back down or whatever um but also for some reason i found that the creativity and ink paper is the easiest one to pull up which like i would have figured it would have been the opposite because typically like unicorn type paper is not easy to pull up in any sense of the word um so i'm just going to take these remaining headers and sticking them on top of like these boxes and then i am going to go ahead and take all of these bougie boxes and just start pulling them down also really quickly like sorry for the chipped nail action going on um my nails literally chipped like this morning as i was trying to like get ready to start filming all this stuff and for <laughs> whatever reason um or not for whatever reason i'm just honestly like straight up too lazy to like paint just a tiny little sliver -y section of my nails i feel like putting this one down here because this box is gonna go in the middle 
and I feel like that should hopefully be enough space to like have a box there and then I guess we could just put a full box like at the top of this and I'm not going to white anything out because honestly like the lines in this planner aren't super like a lot and I think this header is crooked yeah like the lines in this planner aren't like super thick or anything to where I feel like I have to white anything out but if I do that is that and this one is for sure like chopped off but whatever that's fine um but yeah how are you guys doing hopefully everyone is doing pretty solid um i think i'm doing pretty solid for sure have been enjoying my spring break so far um i think we'll do this one here like that so it's like this one would be lower and then some would be higher kind of a thing um yeah i basically stuck to watching a different movie every single day and i'm not even mad about it like um so i think last week i was talking about how like i didn't know what movies to watch these two days so i watched cherry because tom holland and then trial of the chicago seven because i saw like people on the internet saying that it's like a good movie um i need labels for like so i've reorganized my so I've reorganized my sticker collection like actually a billion times and I've had this binder with these insert-y things for actually the longest time. Like I think I've had those since like, I don't even know, 2016, 2016 or 2017. That was like one of the, like that was the last binder that I bought for like a sticker storage or whatever. No, no it wasn't because I bought one after that. Um, but it's one of the last ones that I bought for my sticker storage and it's definitely been through a lot to say like the very stinking least okay so what i'm gonna do right now um is go ahead and start putting all of my classes down so as per usual i'm just gonna like or not as per usual because i don't use the same colors every single week but i'm going to use these labels from Panda Bird Designs. I'm going to use these purple ones to mark my math class. Um, so math is fun. I'm for sure one of those like weird people that actually enjoys having a math class and it's something that I have for sure missed um, just because I, I really like how concrete math is. Um, just like the answer is the answer and that's basically it and there isn't any wiggle room or subjectivity involved in <clears throat> math like it's either the answer or it's not and that is for sure something that I like because I'm not really a look into something that kind of a person um let's see I said it for how many do I have for these so I might as well just use these up to use them um yeah like I don't do I should have put something down there I don't do well with the subjectivity of stuff like English is for sure not my best things because I typically tend to like look into things but in the opposite direction like I'm always very adjacent to whatever the topic is that we're talking about but I'm never like fully there I don't like that <laughs> I don't like not being able to do that um so for sure like English writing literature all that stuff is not my cup of tea in any sense of the word basically um how much did I need of this yeah I don't even know where I was gonna go with that but yeah I'm not very good at the whole subjectivity reading into things analytical lifestyle I also do this a lot like just generically when I'm talking um very distracting especially for train of thought and I snap to sneeze hopefully I don't I don't know like what is up but my allergies have for sure been like through the roof and I feel like I am in the point in my life where I am just discovering a new allergy basically every single day and <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of it I don't like allergies they make my nose all weird stuffy whatever and it's not fun also like because if I sneeze at like if I go to Costco and I sneeze there everyone's gonna give me a weird look and it's gonna be like oh my gosh they, they have the Rona like we're all gonna die here and it's like no it's just allergies I promise but yeah no it's just allergies okay so there is that for the classes and I am so 
excited for this next part. So really quickly, I am just going to show you guys my um, plum paper daily planner. I did do a planner review of this guy, so I'm going to be using this um, just to like write down all of my stuff. Um, I am so, 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 so excited to be in this guy. Like I feel like so far it's already the perfect size for me. And so this is like what these two days have turned out. I don't really like the like decorative highlightery and I especially don't like the stickery decoration part because I feel like I'm losing so much space so I think I'm just gonna stick to like generical only highlight to color code kind of things but I am so far so excited to use this like legitimately cannot um with my excitement Alrighty, so on Monday, it's Coffee Monday, and I'm debating if I want to color block. What color are these guys? That's probably a disgusting sound. I should stop. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. So really quickly, I'm just going to pull in these three for videos. No, I wanted to use the ones with the bows because I don't pull any icons in. Hold on. I'm gonna have to use these eventually though because I can't just like pick them up and put them back down and have them actually go down correctly. Um, so I wanted to use these guys for videos and I have two light pinks and a dark pink. I should have thought this through. So I guess we're just gonna do the opposite. Well, these two can be matching. So this one will for sure be a dark pink and then this one will for sure be a light pink. No, that's not light pink, this one's light pink. And then this one is the dark pink. I think that's the only part that sucks with um, like color blocking e-schedules is like if you want to use specific boxes for certain days, you have to actually do the math beforehand. <laughs> and I don't do that. Um, also, while we're here, we might as well just put these half box. Actually, we could wait. We could wait on that. I'm just going to start going all over the place and I don't really feel like doing that. I actually remember that I'm saving the patterned half boxes for my movie nights on these three days um so coffee monday i guess we could just use one of these like really cute little squared off boxes um so we're gonna take this coffee icon this stick him over here for coffee monday i'm just gonna have to write really small but like it's fine we'll get over it eventually and then i'm gonna take this guy's this two sheets to mark that i have a math test quiz on this day and then we're just gonna put this guy so i don't really know where my camera put me off um but i was just saying that for this week i will be continuing my marvel movie marathon um and i'm actually like really excited so where am i at i'm watching iron man and iron man 2 so for this week i'll be watching like the fifth through the eighth movies and i'm trying to like not watch movies during like I mostly have classes Monday through Thursday, so I'm trying to keep the movies on only Friday, Saturday, Sunday, so we'll see how that turns out in a little bit, like next week. Um, but I have also like planned this out, so like on weeks where I have a lot of exams, like I think the next week I have a math exam and a physics exam, something like that. Um, so like I'll legitimately only stick to like Saturday and Sunday or kind of switch things up to make it so it's not like I can actually focus on school because that's the main priority is school um so there is that for that week or oh I like no it's not um let's see so I did this guy for pre-planning next week and then on this day oh it actually matches that's fun um I don't think the next one's gonna match but that's fine I think we could layer it on the full box just a little bit um, I'm pulling in this bill due to mark that my creativity and ink subscription is due and honestly guys like I am so excited for the next couple of mystery subs from creativity and ink like it's actually kind of insane um just because like I don't know I feel like all of the sneaks that Angela's done so far are so good and especially the washi that she sneaked for create for not creative ink like obviously it's just creative ink um but the washi that she sneaked for the monsters ink subscription looked so cute because it was all of booze like little doors and stuff and i was just so excited to see that so i also pulled in um 
like these little things from old scribble prints co kits so these aren't going to be color blocks just because like they're not a part of this kit but I do like to mark the shows that I watch whenever they come out um, which is also why I'm not going to be watching any movies on Thursdays is because on Thursdays I watch Grey's Anatomy and Keeping Up with the Kardashians and that's already like two hours worth of TV so it might as well be a movie um so Thursday's basically just full she's gone <laughs> we're not gonna talk about her anymore um yeah I used to be like super into tv shows and have like a different movie not a different movie but like two to three different shows to watch every single day and then I was like I don't even like these why am I trying to watch all of these movies if I legitimately don't even like them so for this movie it is going to be for um the Incredible Hulk and this one is one of the ones that I'm still kind of debating if I even want to watch because if I do want to watch it I have to rent it <laughs> and I um so thankfully <clears throat> the phone that I have is a Google Pixel and they like pay you to do surveys and stuff so so I won't really have to pay that much I think like I have enough credit to only have to pay like a dollar of like stuff I'm just gonna put this here for a so squeeze because I didn't have enough room to mark it in an actual box and then we're gonna put this guy for my math quiz and this one was no these both of both of them were from Moonlight Paper Co and then I'm just gonna put this wash hair sticker I guess I put it like right here and then we're gonna take this little hulky guy and this is from Jalen Paper Co and he is absolutely like the cutest thing on planet and I cannot he's gonna stick out like a sore thumb though like I'm not really matching with the spread okay so Thursday and Friday are basically just full for the rest of forever um and then for Sunday I need to put the last full box down so I mean might as well just put them down like right here and then not the last of the bougie but might as well be the last of the bougie so I think I cut out way too many bougie boxes for this but it's fine bougie boxes can for sure be reused in other spreads so we're just gonna like kind of half acidly cut this guy I cut him very wavy did not mean to do that but that's fine as long as it just doesn't go into the full box and he almost did um this way this way this way either way he looks very wavy and very crooked okay cool so we'll just put a box there to make sure that that gets stuck there and then I also need to put the final glitter header so both of these sheets are done now so we're just gonna put this guy here and then what else was I gonna do okay there so there is that for that front and then so like I said on Saturday I don't even think I said it but I will be watching Thor um and for sure very excited to watch Thor because I don't know I feel like it's one of the a he's one of the like classic Avengers so the, the, it's basically he's just one of the classic Avengers um I also need more filming but I, oh I have a third box that is this is this the same in the same color it's not Now I just have to decide what's going to bug me more, having them be the same color or not the same color. Um, also because there's not really a lot of the light pink color, I guess this is the light pink color. So this is going to be for filming um, because I do typically film on Saturdays and I didn't even pull anything out to mark that it was filming. Okay, so that's great. And then I just realized I never even put the weekend banner down. Hmm, okay. Um, but yeah so like Thor is uh, one of the like original six Avengers um and I didn't even see his movie until like last year when I watched all of the movies in order so yeah there's that I don't even think I really needed to say that but there is that I guess we could put something underneath that so we'll put this guy for prepping next week and basically this just means like putting all of my to-do lists in my daily planner um so like whatever I didn't get done this week will get moved into next week to whatever day would make 
the most sense for that. So for marking watching the actual the Avengers movies we're gonna put Fury and then for watching Thor we're gonna put Thor. So both of these are technically from Thor Ragnarok. Those are not the movies that I'm gonna be watching but they're still really really cute. And I think that's it. Those are all the stickers that I pulled out. The only things that I have left are like the cameras that I pulled out to mark the videos that I was gonna like have go live but I'm just gonna use the little bow boxes. And there is still like plenty of stuff in this spread so now i'm just like should i have used all of those um full boxes to make it so i don't know i can't really use them here so i might as well just start sticking some stuff down so we're gonna put the payday on friday because it's my payday we're just gonna put this like in the bottom under here um or we could put it no we're gonna put it at the bottom over here cool cool and i think that's basically it um yeah, because I mean, I guess I technically could put movie night on like one of these three, but I would feel weird putting it on only one of them and not on all of them. Unless there is like a workout -y type script. There is not, nor is there a workout -y type icon. Yeah, so I'm going to say that's it for all of this stuff. So that is it for this spread really quickly. I'm just going to go ahead and take my Pilot J2 in point 30. I don't think I finished any of my thoughts in this like chit chatty section maybe i will try to do like chit chatty through putting down the base and stuff too but i also feel like i need topics to talk about but that's different neither here nor there um so really quickly i'm just going to fill all this out and be back in like two seconds spread all filled out and she looks so magical and gorgeous and honestly this is making me not want to go back to like um generically like just white spacey type things um so we'll see how this turns out how i feel at the end of this month really quickly let me just go ahead and flip through everything that i have left so these are like the two fun little die cuts that i had i don't know how i will be using them but i want to use them either like somewhere within the spread or um like on a cute little scrapbooky page or something so i have like one of these checklists left none of the headers none of the full boxes a bunch of like this functional type page um all of these washi strips and a couple of little bow boxes and then a bunch of these boxes so like angela for sure jam packs all of this stuff into a, like her kits i honestly probably didn't even need to pull in these like panda bird design labels i probably could have just pulled in these labels or even these little squared off boxes to mark my classes so we will learn that for next time because i will for sure be using more of her kits throughout this whole month and i also didn't even mention that i did pull out these scroll prince co half cut headers for this little sidebar section and then this mickey head tape from creativity and ink and i thought it was so cute to like pull it in throughout the entire spread but yeah that is it for this spread hopefully you guys enjoyed don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you enjoyed for more planner content in the future um but yeah as per usual let's just pause take a little bit of a breather take a little bit of a chill pill and deep breath in deep breath out and repeat after me i am open to change um be open to change and new adventures and all that fun stuff and it doesn't have to be like changing your entire like eating habits or changing your career choice or your educational choices or any of that stuff like it could be changing little things like setting limits on social media type stuff adding more exercise into your um like daily routine eating different kinds of food like not necessarily like it always has to be healthy but if you've never had sushi try sushi for the first time or if you've never had anything spicy maybe try a spicy food you know what i mean like be open to change and evolving and doing whatever you need to do to be the most amazing and sparkly human being that you can possibly be and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye guys